Hi and welcome to another video by Baby Auto Repair. Today we have a very simple job. It's a very common problem that a lot of cars have and most people don't even realize it until somebody comes up and tells them that one of your brake lights is burned out. As you can see here, two of the brake lights are on, but you can see the third one back here at the back window is out. That's not lit. So what we're going to do now is we're going to open up the back hatch and we're going to gain access to the socket and we're going to change that light bulb. So, uh, all right, let me uh, let me get okay, in first there. First I'll, I'll show you what to do. We're going to open up the back door and we're going to come up underneath here. I'll bring you in there so you can see what I'm talking about. Okay, so we need to get in underneath here. We need to take this cover off here so we can gain access to that light bulb underneath there. And the way you do that is you see right on the side right here, you have this little slot right here. You have a slot here. And then you also have a little slot right over here too. You would get in here with a small little screwdriver, go underneath here and pry it up. And while you're prying it up here, you're gonna get your fingers in underneath here in the back. It's a little tight, but you get your fingers in right up inside here and you pull with one hand and you pull right there with the screwdriver and that'll pop off that little clip underneath the bottom and pop out the other two little pieces inside here and then we'll take this cover here totally off. So once you do this side over here, then you come back over and you do the same thing on this side. Again, get your fingers under it and you can just pry down on it at the same time when you're prying here with the screwdriver. So, all right, enough talking, let's, uh, let's get started. Okay, now remember what I told you, you don't want to force this and crack it. So. If by chance it's the winter time and this is cold, it's a good idea to have the car in a warm area so that this plastic is actually more pliable, more flexible, and less likely to crack. Um, you could turn the heat on and just leave it cranked up in the car and then do it while it's warm. Or you can just be real careful and just pry it very carefully. You can see how tight that was. We're going to do the same thing over here. And I'll pry this open. And we'll take this off. These are the clips that were actually popping out. Right here, you can see these little tiny push pins right here. And the other piece clips on right up underneath here, of course. Okay, All so right. And then with that cover off, you just take this piece here and you just rotate it counterclockwise comes right out and then the bulb just pulls right out of the socket you just rock it back and forth and it comes right out now let's see what number bulb we have I think it's like a 7440 yep 7440 so let me grab a light bulb and we'll throw it back in Ball back in and now we'll test it to make sure all right of course we're going to test it before we put it back in just to make sure that there's not a problem in the wiring or the socket but in this case the bulb was burned out and then we just put it back in Okay, then we put it back in and we're going to just line it up and once you have this, the bowl back in, you rotate it clockwise and you lock it back in position. And then we're going to take this cover, we're going to put it back on and we're going to pop these little clips back in as well as this end right here. So let's do that. That's it, all set. All right, just remember, if you're taking this off and it's cold, be very careful that you don't actually break it by, uh, by um, twisting it when it's too cold. If it's, if it's cold outside, warm the vehicle up and you'll be fine. All right, um, remember, I always tell you this, there's no such thing as a foolish question. The foolish question is one that you fail to ask. All right, thanks for watching. See you on the next one.